today I'll be making a tiny little envelope. I'm going to need a pen or a pencil. when we get So I'm going to take this from here to here. I'm going to put my black line that I drew out at the end of the paper. I'm going to get my ruler because I can't measure it like that because my stickers will move. So I'm going to get my ruler and place it right beside the stickers. you do there. So my way is a little simple, simpler, but it may not come out the greatest sometimes when you need to do it again, but there's some that I made and it was perfect. There's a couple that I looked like, mm, and I didn't even open it. You just gotta be patient and keep trying, because you can make the perfect one over and over again if you just take your time and do your best. Right now I'm rushing. Your piece of paper, you're not meant to be done with your piece of paper. And just... Okay. Oh, yeah. This is the score now. Yeah, that is... I'm even. I'm even in a moment. Hey, now it's even. Perfectly. Even. Okay. Alright, now we're going to take a little square, square, square. I'm going to draw it and put in glue there because I don't have any glue right this second. So, right here. Okay. Right without the black marking, that's where you need to put your glue. Okay, but then I remember to look like this so far. Mine's a little bit uneven, but this is probably better than mine. And then you need to fold this up. Where my black mark is, and put your glue on the front And then that will stay. You hold it. I put my scissors in there. I hold it like that. So it won't stick to the bottom of my envelope. Because if it sticks there, you're not sliding anything in your envelope. And if you want to put something in your envelope, you have to do it this way. And then you wait till it dries, which I didn't put glue there, so mine's definitely going to dry. And then you wait till it dries, and that will not be. Will be stuck down and perfect. And then I'm just going to rip this off of that paper. And see, this is your note. You wrote a lovely note to your. I don't know. You just slide it down in. And then you fold it. You fold the top file back down. Which mine is uneven. And then you rip this off. 
these are my stickers that I didn't make my square on my line. That would be this one. I have tons of these, so I'll be sure to them out. Alright, so now let's... Now this is like the cutest little, like, February thing. For Valentine's Day stuff. But it actually is March. So it's cute for Valentine's Day. But then it's gonna make a little bit right there, and it's all like an envelope. Perfect square, perfect folds. It will be perfect, but my perfect. I can never make them perfect. But I use them like this, and I give them to people, and then they're like, "Oh, that's so cute," you know. And they don't even notice how much. They don't really notice it's uneven or really care. You know, it's cute, it's thoughtful. Who cares? It's uneven. So, and um, you can like write on the um outside like mom or whatever um i normally i have different hearts that are like colorful and i normally put a heart there or like one of these one of the big ones i'll just leave a blank or white on it you know like since i'm not using this one say i say i want it to go to my mom Okay.